Hey, somebody tell Lep to make a guide for me on how to set up mouse and keyboard. So you want to use mouse and keyboard on Destiny Rising using Bluestacks. Well, do I have the guide for you? First of all, make sure you use Bluestacks 5. I'm using 5.21 because it has no cloud rendering, so there's no input latency. So the first thing I would do is go to Destiny Rising's settings and then controls and then customize the layout. You can move stuff around if you want. I just kept this one default. And then on Bluestacks, he pressed this button over here on the top right called Game Controls, Controls Editor, and then you switch to mouse and keyboard at the top center. And then you can just click this tap spot thing and drag it to all the places where you want to click. So like F for Super, V for that ability, Q for that ability, Tab for Ghost, I for inventory, so you just drag those everywhere with tap spot. You can right click it to get more info. I just delete it. For WASD, I drag over the D-pad over where the movement thing is over here and add WASD for movement. Now the aiming and free looking is probably the part that is confusing. So here's free look. Just put it in the middle of the screen. This key doesn't do anything. It's this one. And then you drag in aim pan shoot. I set my start stop to alt. So when I press alt, my mouse controls free look now. I press alt again. Now I can just click wherever I want to click because I added, you know, right click to the ADS button. I can now aim and, you know, like that. And anytime I can press alt to give myself my cursor. I also turn off on screen controls when I'm playing, so I have to see things. Oh, that was confusing. So, fire with left click, you have to click this little guy right here and drag him onto the shoot button over here. And I have fire with left click on and look around mode on. And then I had to tweak my sensitivity for my own comfort, but I changed it down to 0.3 sensitivity on X and Y. One thing that's confusing is that the social space has these buttons in a slightly different place. And so some things in the social space don't work. One of the things I couldn't figure out was how to create a bind for sparrowing. So I have to click Alt, go free mouse mode, click, and then drag up to sparrow. And then go back into free look mode. And then don't click anything and let it just boost around. But I couldn't figure out a way to keep bind that. All right, so settings inside that need to be changed. Uh, controls, firing mode, all these need to be set to tap to fire in order to work correctly. I'm on mixed. I don't know what that really does, but that's just what I'm on. Aim assist off. All this stuff is off. I'll just scroll through these settings. I don't think any of these really mattered. I'm tap ADS, not hold ADS, but you can set it to whatever you want. Sensitivity I played with for a while and ADS sensitivity still feels off. I did acceleration off, not ADS, ADS immediate, and then custom sensitivity. I have this off. I I toggle back and forth between having this off and on and it still doesn't feel quite right with these settings, but you know, everyone's going to be different. So in blue Sacks, settings, graphics, destiny rising only runs with Vulcan, I believe Vulcan rendering. And if you want full screen mode to work like windowed borderless, go to your NVIDIA control panel, manage 3d settings, Vulcan OpenGL. Prefer layered on DXGI swap chain. I don't know what that means, but the end result is full screen equals windowed borderless. I think that's it. Most important thing though, Blue Sacks 5, Pi 64, no cloud computing, faster rendering, less input lag. Most important thing. You're welcome as tech, Ross.